Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to show you how to get something pretty close to Figma's dev mode without paying a cent. If you've been frustrated by the paywall or you're not a university student eligible for free dev mode access, this video is for you. By the end of this tutorial, you'll know how to inspect elements and get those key measurements in Figma's free version, just like you would in dev mode. So let's dive right in and unlock some pro-level tricks. First things first, let's talk about dev mode in Figma. If you've tried to access it, you probably found that it's reserved for paid plans or for students who apply through their university. That can feel like a roadblock, but don't worry, there's actually a smart workaround that lets you mimic the most useful features of dev mode in the free tier. Let's start with inspecting elements, which is one of the most valuable aspects of dev mode for developers and designers alike. Here, what you do in your Figma file, just right click on the object you're interested in. It can be a button, a text box, or any element at all. When you right click, look for the copy paste as option, then hover over it, you'll see a variety of choices pop up. Now select copy as code and specifically pick copy as CSS. What you're doing here is telling Figma to give you all the underlying CSS styling for that object, which is exactly what dev mode would help you uncover. Once you've copied the CSS, just paste it into whatever program or document you like, for example, Notepad V's code or even a simple text editor. This gives you all the details about how that object is styled. The colors, the font sizes, border, radius, shadows, and so on. It's a great way to inspect elements just like you'd normally do in dev mode and it's totally free. Don't worry if it feels a bit technical at first. Once you get in the habit, it becomes second nature, and it's a very powerful way to reverse engineer or replicate designs. Now let's tackle another feature people love about dev mode, measuring distances between objects. Normally, when you're in dev mode, you get to see the specific numbers for spacing and alignment, which is super helpful for development work. But here, the trick, in the free version of Figma, you can still get those measurements. Just click on any object to select it. Then, while holding down the Alt key on your keyboard, start moving the object around. You'll notice that numbers appear, showing you the exact distance between your selected element and other objects or guides in your design. This works in real time, so as you drag, you can see how things line up and adjust on the fly. It might take a moment to get used to holding Alt while you move things, but trust me, this feature alone can save you so much time and helps make your layouts pixel perfect, even without dev mode. And if you're used to measuring with a ruler in everyday life, it's kind of the same principle here, those numbers are just digital rulers. So that's how you can get two key features of Figma's dev mode, absolutely free. Try these tricks out and see how much more efficient your workflow becomes. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like, drop a comment below with any questions or suggestions for future tutorials, and don't forget to subscribe for more tips just like this. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.